Hey everyone! In this short tutorial video I will show how to make it easier for customers to find your products. For this we will combine the product grid with the tabs widget. With this combination you can show for example, new arrivals, popular products, or your best sellers, arranged in a grouping of four elements on each tab. But of course you can create any grouping or collection of your choice with different widgets inside. Okay, so let's dive in and build our own layout. At first we add a tabs widget which will be our wrapper element. I set up a solid style by removing the border and adding a light background color. I also change the default color of the title and the active color. On the content tab we can give the name of our tabs. In my case this will be new arrivals, popular products, and best sellers. After we are ready with this, we can create the content which we would like to show on the different tabs. Let's drag a product grid widget right under the tabs. I do some design modification now. So I change the skin to custom. Set the limit to 4. As you can see in the listing types you can choose from featured products, prices drop, new products, best sales, or even custom products. Now I chose the new products. Switch off add to cart button. And on the style tab I set the image hover animation to grow. I suggest you explore the other settings as well so you can create a design that fits your page. In the section settings I change the columns gap to none. So the grid will take the maximum width of the area without paddings. Ok, now we will save our section as a template. Click on the save icon. Give it a name. And save it. Great! Let's duplicate the section and change the products to the ones you want to display in the second tab. When you are ready save this section as a template too. OK. Finally we can make the third tab. Duplicate the section again. The reason I reused the previous section is to get the same design for each tab. If you are ready, save the section too. Great! After we are ready with the contents, let's go to Creative Elements Template List. Here you can see the previously created templates. And in each line you will find the short codes. Copy the short code. As you can see they all have the same structure, the only difference is the ID. Let's go back to the editor and remove the sections here. Don't worry, with this you will not lose the previously saved templates. OK, now click on the tabs widget. Open the first tab parameters. In the content insert the previously copied short code. Do the same for the next tab. Insert the short code. But don't forget to change the ID for the next one. And finally, let's make the third one too. When you click outside the widget, the editor will load the templates automatically to the tab. You can check them one by one. Let's save our work. And view the page. It looks cool. So this is the way how you can create a compact product grid on Press the Shop with Creative Elements. If you want to change the contents of the tab, just click on the quick edit button right here. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Go ahead and explore the possibilities on your own site too. Have fun creating and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tips and tutorials.